Hello and welcome back to Twilight Princess with DP Gaming. I'm Phil. I'm Dylan. Last time we found the mysterious cannon and we dumped it on Lake Hylia. But we haven't quite got enough rupees to fix it just yet. So we are here to do the rupee game and try and get some rupees. But first, a basket. Which basket? See, there's all these white ones and I'm like, I don't want that white one. But do I want this brown one or this grey one? I think the... Hmm... I think, I think we want to go for one of the distinct coloured ones. The, come on, this guy... Shame we don't have that golden cuckoo from earlier. This guy, he was by himself over here. He knows he's better than them. Yeah, he, he, he doesn't waste his time with those losers. Yeah, okay. So... Oh, maybe you have to talk to him first. Hi. Yes. Okay, 20, 20 rupees. rupees. Okay, so we put a bit of money down to do this, but if you're as good as you say you are, because off, off, off screen he was saying some serious, you know, he was bigging himself up, major. Okay, I've got to work out which way to go then. Not seeing a lot this way. Well, there's a blue down there. Yeah, it looks like there's a blue over here as well. Mm. Surely you still want to be trying to land on the thing though. Yeah, okay, I'm going to go this way. Oh. Oh, look at. So far, we've only made a loss of 28 rupees. 23. Ooh. So, do, can I hit the top one? I. Oh, it's rotating and everything. Oh, this is a. Uh... Oh, okay. What do we get here? It's 20. 20? Alright, so we've already, we've only made a 3 rupee loss now. And there's the 10. So right. we made the profit, but... Oh, not enough. Not enough. We still need 40 rupees. Right, so are you going to try again or should we just head over to uh, Agatha? Let's head over to Agatha. Let's bribe, um, bribe her with some bugs. I'm disheartened. Okay, so we'll see you. We'll see you there. Yes. Are you gonna do some transition noises, or was that? That was just for the owl statues. I'm not doing them ever again. Okay. <laughs> right. And we're back here outside Agatha's house. Um, We've gotta go give her some. Uh, bribe her with some bugs, essentially. Yeah. Cause the thing is, you get fifty for one, then a hundred for the pair, isn't it? Yeah, I think so. So. Do we just do we just give her one and then or do we? Well, do the thing we... is, we gave her one pair last time. The thing is, we don't. We're going to be going straight to a dungeon, so there's no point getting more than we need. Yeah. So we might as well. Let's just do this one. Yeah. Top corner, easy. A an ant. Yep. With wings. You get ants with wings. Flying ants. Who wants an ant to come? To... I don't understand this girl. Somebody who loves bugs life. I guess, yeah. Or, or the film ants. ants. Yeah, I was gonna say. It's weird how films like that come out like opposite each other, isn't it? Yeah. It's like, oh, we're gonna make the best ant-themed movie. It's like um, Overwatch and Battleborn. Yeah. Well, to be honest, with those two movies as well, one was just a lot better than the other. Yeah, Ants was really kind of crappy. I thought you were going to say Ants was the good one. I was being like, oh, are we going to get into an argument here over which is the best ant themed movie? The bugger was not. Oh, yeah, technically it is. And they are ants, aren't they? They don't look like ants because they're all weird colours, but that's to make it friendly. What? You, like, yeah, the blue ants. Yeah. And then there's the grasshoppers. Yes. Those evil grasshoppers. Yeah. And those shenanigans. And the circus. That is a bit of a weird movie as well, isn't it? Yeah. I mean, it's probably got more creativity in, you know, open quotes. But, um... Yeah, fucking weird. They make a massive bird out of stuff as well, don't they? Uh, you want to go to the lake, are you? Here. Yes. Here. Here. Yes. So, yeah, I was playing for the first bit, but we switched over. Because this is a... 
This is Phil's turn. Yeah, it's my, my turn at the controls again. Dylan's had the last five and a half parts. Yeah. So, you know, now it's Phil's time to shine. We're, we're, we're doing a, an extra long recording session. Because, uh... Turns out we've got holidays back to back. Yeah, we've got back to back holidays. I'm um I'm off to Spain. Hmm. All right, what are you doing, Phil? I'm house sitting. Oh my wow! But so they're we're... going to Vegas. When you say when you say we've got holidays back to back, you mean me and your parents have got holidays back to back? I haven't. <laughs> well, you know, at least you get you get to go home for a bit. Yeah, well, I suppose there won't be anyone there. Yeah, It'll be me and the dog. We will be fine actually. Right, he's gonna fix our cannon. One, two, three, four. Good thing this ain't Majora's Mask, otherwise it'd have wasted the entire three days. Exactly, it took him four days to fix it. You know, when the fate of the world's on the line, four days, what were we doing? Twiddling thumbs. This is when we come back, we've got a full thing of rupees. Yeah. God, can you imagine if you actually had to wait four days? Yeah, without the sun song, I'm not, yeah. you, you'd literally just have to go out to the field because time doesn't even pass in like Hylia normally, no. does it? Yeah, it'd either be the desert or Hyrule Field. Oh, jeez, that'd be annoying. Because you have to wait for the, uh, the bigger run sword, not Ocarina of Time, but you can just play the sun song like three or four times. Yeah. And then you, it's done. We can have all the fun we want. Yeah. In our magic cannon. So, like this. We walk around to the back. It's good that you made this ignition so that a person can literally pull themselves into the, the butthole of the cannon. Yeah. And ignite it at the same time. Oh Aww. shit, it's Randy. Randy. He's been waiting in the shadows. It doesn't seem to be anything other than steel. I don't understand how it's doing this. You know, the ancient Hylians had weird tech. Because Hyrule so, seems to be a bit weird with its timeline in terms of technology, doesn't it? So is this a, a throwback to... Not a throwback, a throw forward to um, Skyloft, then? I think so. Maybe why Skyloft... I've heard Skyloft's quite small. Yes. Yeah, that's probably why. Because <laughs> it's based off a temple. <laughs> well, well, no, it's, it's, so Skyloft isn't like this, but there are several other islands in the sky. Yeah. Pretty sure. Sky City of the Uka. Tour of the City. Yay! Ooh! Is, um, that's, um, is that one of Randy's friends? You reckon? Yeah. This is Big Brother. Ooh. Death Lord. <laughs> oh, Randy. You really are the runt of the litter. <laughs> this is Younger Brother. Yeah. Sky Demon. You won't believe it. There's a... There's a dragon raging outside the city walls. Really, Randy? We just saw a bird fly over. I thought it was your brother. Hmm. I mean, he says check for survivors. You see several of these guys walking around this temple completely unharmed by anything. Yeah. So I don't think it's too too much of a arduous thing. Um, there's stuff on the bottom of the, the water. Shall we investigate? All right. Why not? Boo. I guess this is necessary. It's gonna be the compass. Maybe. Oh, nope. No, some nice rupees. Could have done with that a few minutes ago, but whatever. Don't worry, there's one over here. That's gotta be the compass. Compass. Money on compass. Money on compass. Is Dylan right? Find out next. No, it's too early for that. Way too early. <laughs> Way too early with the cut and everything. Oh. No water bombs. Do we need to use them here? No. I'm not sure why they gave us water bombs ahead of regular bombs, which we just have just as few of, if not less. Yeah, we're, we're quite low. I, I don't know who keeps on using them. So we go into the shop first. Yeah, why not? What do we sell? What do they sell in the shop? Um, I'm not sure. I kind of just rolled through them, huh? Yeah. What have we got? Oh, look at the bubble chairs. They look nice. Yeah, very fancy. Not very comfortable for people, but... Probably great for these guys. 
All right, so this is uh this is uh Randy. Sorry for it. earlier. Okay, so we're taking uh Randy with us. Yeah, walk you to the shop. Most of them warp you out, but you can't do that here. What if? Ah, Windings, my favourite font. You are Hylian, no? I speak a little Hylian. You understand? So what if what if Randy Yuku's name is Randy Yuku? Not because his first name is Randy, but because that's the the adjective that most well describes them. Oh right. And she's just a Randy Yuku. Oh. Yeah, I think that 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 might be right. Yeah, she ran off to the shop so she could get some before she had to come with us. Yeah. Yeah. And that illegitimate child of hers. Oh, jeez. Tell you, society's going to hell in a handbasket. Poor little... Other... Sh Shandy Uku. Shandy Uku. So what's, what's that little circle thing over there? Is that... Oh, what, well, at the bottom of the map? Yeah. It's a cannon to get back again. Ah, oh, okay. Alright, so for this we now... Oh, wait, no, we don't want to do that. No! Ah! Bing! Oh. Bing! Bing! Google! Yahoo? Ask Jeeves! <laughs> Is that even a thing anymore? I think so. So I haven't, it's just stuff I've not seen in years. It's just people use Google, they make jokes about Bing. That's one of the two options, really. Yeah. Sometimes Yahoo tries its, tries its little heart out to yeah. like, come up on Facebook or something. Yeah, but, I'm actually impressed that Yahoo's still going. Yeah. Like, they had enough money to even make an extra series of community, and it's like, where are you getting that money from? No one uses Yahoo. Yahoo Answers, that's what it is. That's what it is. All those people getting those totally legit Yahoo Answers. Can If I have sex but I'm pregnant, can my child also get pregnant? <laughs> <laughs> that's one of my favourite ones. you got to think how many of them are legit and how many of them are just made up by somebody. Now, what you definitely need here... Can, does, it, does it help us fly? Yeah. Oh shit. Don't step on those floor panels. Yeah, so what we what we definitely need here is uh, the hook shot. We don't need the iron boots anymore, really, do we? No. Well, not until we get outside again. Yeah. Well, I tried. Ah. Take my Uku. Ah, that didn't work and he died. Ah, that's not what we mean to do, but all right. Bam! Stabby, stab, stab. Uh, right, so how do you get. Oh, that was close. It uh, was, um, that's fine. This is a lot easier. This is definitely necessary. Was that rupee actually making it. shudder? Is that also a pot? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Lots of rupees, right, so then you go up there. Up here. And now, oh, come on, you silly link. Uh, take a Randy off the wall. Or this. It's mine now. That won't help you fly. <laughs> won't help him fly either now. Whee! Damn. Okay, so up here. Uh, yes. Is this, right. the, is this the first Zelda game to have an, a sky temple? That's the question. Uh, is, obviously, Ocarina doesn't. It was meant to have a wind temple, but that ended up being a forest temple. Um, they have Majora's the, Mask doesn't. It they has have just, a really tall tower in the Wind Waker. Yeah. Oh, right, Tower of the Gods. Yeah. No, but Wind Waker's more going under the water, isn't it? Than yeah. so far above. Use your. that one. Okay. You went too far out. He is just not difficult to beat at all, really, is he? No, he's just a bit... He really... just can't steal a shell like the others. Yeah. Um, um, which direction shall we take? Just go straight on, why not? Straight on. 
Why not? We have to knock these all out eventually. So what? I I've forgotten the theme of these te this temple. Sky. Yeah, well, obviously, but like, <laughs> what what do we have to do to get the boss? The boss is it's, it's kind of a little bit weird. This one, isn't it? Yeah, we have to get like propellers running. Oh, okay, so we can't do this. We go this way yet. No, and we can't go this way without the item of this temple either. Oh, this is the boss way anyway. Yeah. It's fine, we won't need those pots later. So we're we getting need to go left. Spawn. When we come in, I think. What, across the falling floor? Yeah. But okay. I don't think we can reach the... Um... I'll trust you on this one. If, you, if you're if you lying, though, you know. Never trust anything oh. you say again. Okay. I mean, I lied earlier when I said I was really good at that chicken thing. Oh, yeah. You lie a lot, really. Yeah. Well, to be honest, it's not like, you know, you're not meaning to lie. You just think you're better than you are. I say that 50% of the words I say are lies. I'd say that, but that would be a lie, too. Yeah. Bam. Boom. Uh, see, that, that those, those like things on the floor make you think of... I was about to say it makes you think of the spinner and then, then we need the spinner. Yeah, I was gonna say, it makes you think of the spinner for a reason. It's one of those Whoops. it's one of those weird um it's not weird at all, but like it's it's a temple where everything seems to be That's nice. Everything you seem to need every item in this temple. Or at least for a little while. Yeah. Whereas in previous temples you don't really need to well, I switch over as much. Which is weird, because this one, it's not as if this one's the only one you have to do last, you have to do them in order. Yeah. But to be honest, there's, there's items that are immediately more applicable, such as the hook shot, whereas the spinner is a bit of a difficult one to find any use for. Yeah. Although they do in the last temple, to be fair, you have to go up the stairs, don't you, because the stairs are falling down. Oh. But it still seems like a bit of a pointless one. See, putting a shield up there oh, sh wouldn't actually uh, help Oh, we need a key. Oh, okay. So did you lie? No, no, no. Wait, we need to do the spinner thing first. Uh, did we? Yeah. Oh, okay. Just for my benefit. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Because yeah. then it makes you not a liar. Yeah. Anyway, we will go over and try and find the small key this other way, and we will see you next time on DP Gaming Plays Twilight Princess, where I have been Phil. And I've been Dylan. Join us in the sky for another episode. Bye.